What's going on guys, Why here, and I'm gonna show you inside of Cloud PBN. First of all, uh, Cloud PBN is broken up into two parts. The customer gets both of these when they uh, purchase the front end package. So they're gonna get access to the, the web-based software, Cloud PBN itself, and then they're gonna get access to this WordPress plugin, which is the slave WordPress plugin, uh, which is installed on each high PR domain that you wanna control. Okay, you set it up once, with the, the WordPress plugin, and then it's set up forever. And you can always control those sites uh, from within Cloud PBN, and you never have to log into your high PR site WordPress accounts again, okay? And that's what's so great about Cloud PBN. Now, this WordPress plugin is virtually worthless without this um, the web-based software, so there's no way anyone can share this plugin for free. They need an account to be able to work Cloud PBN, okay? so. I have three sites open here. These are my three high PR domains, okay? I purchased these domains, um, and I'm gonna use them to build up my um, network, just as an example, my blog network. So I have the, the 10 site package, but let's assume I just have the three site package, and these are my three high PR domains, okay? So I'm gonna go ahead and log into Cloud PBN, and as you can see, this is the dashboard. It's very web 3.0. Um, I have the admin panel over here, um, up here I have a notifications panel where it tells me everything that is going on. As you can see, I added two new sites uh, just before I started this video. It tells you how many backlinks you've generated, how many second tier backlinks you've generated, and all the news is on the homepage. So let's jump right in. Also, I'm gonna show you the activity tab. Uh, this is also where you can see all of the activity that's going on with Cloud PBN. So it's pretty awesome. You can watch everything live right from within the app itself. So if I go to the Sites tab and click Your Sites, you'll see that I've added two websites so far. Uh, just as an example, and I'm gonna show you how you add another site um, by adding uh, one more, my third site, okay? So here are the two sites that I've added, bridgesheer.com and viralvolcano.com. As you see, they're both approved. And up here it says you can add eight more sites because I have the 10 site package, okay? So I'm gonna click add new site, and this is how simple it is. All you have to do is enter the URL of the site that you're adding. So for me, it's uh, wi slash apps.com. And then you upload the plugin to the WordPress site, which I have already done on this site. All you go is to uh, settings and uh, slave. And all these tutorial videos are in the membership area, so all of your customers will know how to do this, but it's very simple. All you do is go to master keys, and there are two keys here. There's a site key, which you copy and paste right in there, and there's a site secret, which you copy and paste and click add site. Just like that, Cloud PBN will hook up with your high PR site and it will be able to control it from now on. Also, all of the code is encrypted between that connection. Okay, so I now have three high PR domains, three sites added inside of Cloud PBN. As you can see, I can add up to seven more sites. Now, I'm gonna hop right into the control panel as all these sites are approved, the connection is good. I'm gonna go to optimization, which is the first tab. It's very simple, I can select all the sites that I wanna optimize, all the high PR domains, and click go. And Cloud PBN will queue that in just a second, we'll get some notifications up here saying the optimization has been done. So. There it is, three, three uh, new notifications, three sites, perfect. Now, what optimization is, Cloud PBN is going out there on all three of the sites and setting it so that all of the posts show up on the homepage of the site. That's where all the link juice is, that's where all the PR is on your high PR domains. So, all of the posts will be shown on the homepage. Whenever Cloud PBN makes a new post, it's right on the homepage and it shows the full post. So it's perfectly optimized for a blog network. After I've done that, uh, which I have, so I'm gonna go to create backlink, which is the first step, and this is where the magic happens. I can select all the sites that I wanna post content on and build for my money site um, directly from my link network, okay? So I have three sites in my link network. I select the, the target keyword that I wanna use for content generation, so this is what it will use to build the articles on your sites. I'm gonna use bread as an example. Let's say uh, I'm running this blog network and I got a new SEO client, so I'm gonna you know, set up my blog network to rank his bakery site. So bread for uh, the keyword and the target keyword for media search. So that's what it will use to find images or videos for the content. I'm gonna do bread tips just so it's a little bit more specific. 
Now I just put his money site URL here. So just as an example, I'll do apple.com. There are three types of anchor text you can use. Generic anchor text, which is uh, pre-written anchor text. For example, click here, learn more, see why. Just very generic anchor text, which is great uh, for Google. You know, you don't want to hammer uh, keyword anchor text too much. Otherwise, Google will slap you. So you can select generic. You can select random where it will select just a, a couple random words out of the content that it posts and make that the anchor text. Or you can select custom and it will give you three new boxes where you can type the anchor text for bridgeshere.com, viral volcano, and why app. So if you wanted to use the keyword for one, bread tips, and then I can do uh, learn more, see why. Perfect. So I got two generic anchor text and a, a keyword specific anchor text. So. Now all I have to do is click generate backlinks and it says they were queued. So in just a second, we'll get some more notifications saying that cloud PVN has went out there and posted on all of these sites. So as you can see, three new notifications have appeared in the top right, which means the backlink creation has been completed. So I'm going to go to one of our sites here, uh, bridgeshere.com and click the home button. And we should see an article on the home page. Yep. Um, showing a, a video image, all that. Let's go to another one. So we got a completely unique article compared to the last one. We have an image, video, all that good stuff. And we even have a link somewhere here. It is at the bottom. Learn more with anchor text that we typed in. So we have a, you know, an article shown in full um, about bread, completely relevant with a video and an image. And it's linking with the anchor text that we supplied. And it's posted on all of these sites in just a matter of seconds. Now I'm going to go to the next part, which is second tier backlinks. I'm going to select all sites and click uh, your target keyword here, which will be bread tips for this example. And then the number of backlinks that I want to generate for each high PR site. So basically what cloud PBN is going to do, it's going to go out there. I'm going to click go. It's going to go out there, go on Vimeo, these different video sites and downloads videos about bread. And then it's going to upload them to YouTube and link back to all of the high PR sites. So this is going to take a minute. Oh, it's already completed. How fast was that? So just like that, uh, cloud PBN went out there and downloaded those videos and uploaded them Every 10 minutes. Cloud PBN, uh, the slave plugin on each of these sites refreshes and checks the queue to see if there's anything that it should do. So for example, the slave plugin on viralvolcano.com, every 10 minutes will check uh, cloud PBM's queue and be like, okay, I need to download two videos from Vimeo, upload them to YouTube with uh, bread tips as the keyword and go get these videos that are related to bread. So each site will do that. It's hosted on uh, the server that's used for each site. So the speed is the same on all the different sites. So there's no way it can be slowed down because it's controlled by the slave plugin that's on each separate server. Okay. So it's perfect. Just like that guys, just in a few minutes, and you can honestly do it in seconds. Uh, I was able to create this link pyramid here with my high PR blog network. Here's my client's site, the Baker, the money site. I was able to post uh, on three high PR sites, my entire blog network pointing at his money site with relevant content, images, videos, correct anchor text, all that good stuff. And then I was up, able to upload two videos for each high PR domain pointing directly to that high PR domain with also uh, relevant content. So, Imagine if I had 10 high PR sites in my blog network, how powerful uh, of a link pyramid that you could really create in such a short amount of time just by clicking a few buttons. And that's the power of cloud PBM guys.